baby cakes. I'm home. Ah, it's fucking freezing outside. And that's coming from someone with an explosion quirk. Where are you? And what's that sweet smell? Have you been baking or something? You're in the kitchen. Well, good. You can help me put these groceries away. You want me to close my eyes? Why? <sighs> fine, fine, I'll do it. I'm coming in, eyes closed, I swear. Okay, can I open my eyes now? Oi, what are you up to? <clears throat> are you recording me right now? <sighs> I swear, if this is another one of your pranks, I'm going to chase your bratty ass around this house. Not a prank, huh? Well, can I open my eyes yet? Great. All right, firecracker. What is this? <sighs> I know it's another damn Baku plushie, but why is it in a crib? Read the cake, too. What's on the cake? Yeah, yeah, I'm reading. Firework. It says, thanks for knocking me up? Wait, you're pregnant? When did you find out? H how far along are you? You've gone to the doctor, right? Of course I'm all hyper. We're going to be parents. Are you going to keep the baby? <laughs> Oi, I know you wouldn't go through all this setup if you weren't going to, but I want to make sure you know I support you, Firework. But we're going to be parents? <laughs> ah, you're amazing, Firecracker. You're going to be the best mother in the world. Definitely a better one than my old hag. <laughs> yeah, it's all in good fun. Just teasing. I know you and the lady hang out a bunch. And the last thing I need from her is a smack upside the head. She's already going to strangle me with excitement when she finds out she's going to be an actual grandma. You think your parents are going to lose their minds too? I thought so. Who else have you told anyway? Just me and the doctors. Well, I am absolutely honored to be the first to know, Firework. Of course you'd go through the crazy amount of effort to bake the cake and... Wait, does that mean you sewed these dolls yourself? Huh, that's actually pretty damn impressive. You've gotten so many of these dolls that you're an expert, apparently. <laughs> well, at least we know the baby is going to be very entertained and surrounded by a bunch of plushies. Oh, great. Now you think you've got a reason to buy every plushie you lay your eyes on, huh? We've already got a pile going, but... And I'm only saying this for the baby's sake. <sighs> Go wild. Oi, oi, oi. I see that look in your eyes. Wild doesn't mean rabid. <sighs> Jeez, now I'm going to end up shopping with you, aren't I? Making sure you don't end up drowning in baby stuff. Well, I think you know I kind of like the adrenaline chasing you around the mall provides me. Think we should probably try to plan out how to tell our parents? Or are we just going to do the whole pregnancy reveal and invite anyone we want to tell? I could work. <laughs> You're such a little gremlin, you know that? You're going to give our parents even more great heroes doing the announcement this way. But this part of you is one of the million reasons I love you. Ah, baby cakes. I don't think I'd have married you if I didn't love you. I know you were joking, but I think the next nine months are going to be intense, and I want you to know that I've got you. I love you, and I want you to know that even when you get to that part of the pregnancy where you can't stand the sound of my chewing and breathing, that I still love you. Babe, of course I know all about the hormonal pregnancy stuff. With some of our co-workers having gone through it already, some multiple times already, I've made sure to pay attention. Deku's dumbass has teased me about it, and I've nearly strangled him for it. 
Yeah, this is an important moment. One I'll never forget. One I know you'll never forget. Guess we should decide on which room is getting converted into a nursery, huh? Alright, we can do that later. And that emergency meeting call? When should we do that? Or do you just want to send the group chat a text and wait the whole of, you know, 20 seconds it'll take for them to get their asses over here? <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. They'd be here even sooner than that. Anyone besides those in the group chat that you want to give a good scare to? Perfect. Go ahead and send the text then. Besides, the cake you baked is gigantic. Won't need help eating it all. Absolutely not, Firecracker. We are not eating this giant thing by ourselves. How did you manage to do all this while I was at the market anyway? It took me a couple hours at most. You prepped it all last night while I was sleeping and hid it so I wouldn't see anything during breakfast. <laughs> You're a smart one. So that's why the house smells like a bakery. You just had to put the thing in the oven and decorate it. And the dolls? You've been planning on them for a while now. Baby, why didn't you tell me you wanted to start a family? I'm definitely glad you're pregnant, but we could have been trying together. You wanted to surprise me. <laughs> well, you definitely managed that. I'm very surprised, Firework, in all the best ways. <laughs> uh, but don't plan on surprising me too much. I'm already as vigilant as hell when it comes to you, but... Now I'm not going to let a moment pass by without knowing what's going on with you. You got jokes, huh? <laughs> Come here. <laughs> oh, now you're gonna stop teasing? Are you sure? Or should I keep tickling you to make sure you really surrender? <laughs> I don't know, maybe I should keep at it. <sighs> Good to know you're going to behave now. Besides, I don't think you want our family and friends coming over to see you crying from getting tickled so much. And you know I would absolutely keep on even after they got here until you gave in. Well, I'm glad I gave you a good laugh. Gotta keep you and the baby happy now. Not that it'll be too hard, right? If the baby gets your personality, the situation will have to be dire as hell to see them upset. Yeah, but. Pouting and being a little shit is a whole lot different than being upset. I know our kid is destined to be a giant brat, but I love him anyway. Though, maybe we shouldn't let them be like I was when I was a kid. I was definitely a work in progress. Well, yeah, you always have seen the best of me, though. I mean it. I want our kid to be a good kid, and I want to be a good dad to them. You think I'm going to be a good dad? You're always so sweet. You know that? All right, fine. I'll calm down on the self-deprecating talk. It's not good for the baby, huh? Can the baby even hear us yet? <laughs> I see. So you're a baby because you're carrying the baby. Did I get that right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You've made your point, baby cakes. I hope you're ready for me to turn into an absolute menace, you know. I'm gonna be a dad. My beautiful wife is gonna be a mom. We're having a baby. Hell yeah, I'm excited. This is the best news you could have given me. I mean it. It's a whole new life starting for us today, and I promise I'm taking care of you both. You don't have to worry about anything. I've got you. I love you, Firework. <laughs> All right. Now let's go check out the room. We're making it to a nursery and wait for everyone to arrive, yeah? Ah, because once they're here, you know how much of a pain in the ass it is to get a second of a break. That's my firecracker. I hope you weebs enjoyed the first episode of this three-part pregnancy Christmas special audio roleplay featuring Katsuki Bakugo from My Hero Academia. What kind of preparations do you think Katsuki will dive into? Are you thinking up any possible names for this incoming baby? What types of weird cravings do you think you'll end up having? Please visit my Patreon if you would like to hear some of the spicier content. Link in the description and pinned comment below. Detroit, smash that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. It's 100% free and turns you into a certified weeb seven days a week. 
What kind of pregnancy adventures are you looking forward to experiencing with Kotsky? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, that's enough for me. My name is Bizarre, and I'll see you weebs in the next video. Cue the outro. He's bizarre. He's bizarre. He's bizarre. Bizarre steps to his mic to make his little sounds. The weebs jump up and cheer. Hit subscribe and stick around. ASMR most times with Minecraft on the side. Some modded games with Deku there to soothe you when you cry. Go ahead, close your eyes, kick back and put him on. And get even more bizarre through his Patreon. Need a friendly pal to get you through the night? Well, get headphones, take a listen, and maybe hit subscribe. He's bizarre.